Absolutely. Absolutely. I do YouTube and and I do YouTube IRL streaming. I don't have stream apps, you know. Wait, 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 wait. You're going to talk about always a victim. Ask him about Peanut and watch him freak out because it's all about him. Sociopath? Melanie broke her dog's leg yesterday after I broke up with her at 6 o'clock in the morning. They broke, they broke the dog's leg. Boom, donation. In your face. They broke the dog's leg. Came back, you haven't seen that dog in two months. Always be like that dude that's just like treated like this. This is not fair. This is not fair. It's not fair. Drop dead Aaron and do everyone a favor. Well, we're going to expose that to you. TMZ and everybody's watching you guys. We're going to expose you. Um, hey. hey. So, as you know, Mel. Um, hey. hey. So, as you know, Melanie's in jail. Um, but can you order my coffee for me, please? Yeah. All right, um, and just keep just keep me in the loop of everything. I've got everything under control, so. Um, you good? I'm okay. I'm 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 sick of um, de de being abused by girls again. Yeah. Just like Lena. Yeah. Yeah, it's not okay. Like like she cho she she ha she has a felony. Yeah, I saw I saw the paperwork. People have been posting it, so I definitely saw it. Well, not okay. Like, like she cho she she ha she has a felony. Yeah, I saw I saw the paperwork. People have been posting it, so I definitely saw it. Well. I'm well, okay, but thank, thank you for asking me that. I love you. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate it. It's her own fault. Like it is her not own. your fault. That's what the, all the cops said. They said this is her doing. She did this, not you. Thank you so much, Jane. Um, yeah, Jamie. It's like nobody's fault but her own. Yeah, I, and I did everything. How good was I? How much did I spend? Forty, forty-five, fifty thousand dollars in the last three months on her. Yeah, it's been a lot of money. How much? Probably like at least forty k. Yeah, I get. I we get this. We order. I order a, a, a elliptical machine, and she says, "Don't buy me something that's not assembled." Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, um, I think there's a stigma in men that are uh, that get abused or, or, or are in abuseful. Uh, relationships and they don't want to talk about it and I tried I tried to do everything I could to defuse thank you so much Marie Huntley um, I tried to defuse the situation um, uh, to where there was no cops involved and um, and basically that's just like not how it went down because she just wouldn't leave me alone and I offered I said I'll, I'll get you I'll get the storage unit that I'll, I'll pay for the storage I'll do everything I can but, you know, she's freaking out, lunged at my neck, um, like really hurt me, like really badly. Um, and I'm just like, I'm a singer. Like you went for my, like, you went for like my, like, ugh. just like really, I'm taking these, uh, they're a pure hemp, um, uh, pure hemp company makes them, they're all, all CBD. You guys can see that, but it's for anti-inflammation because she smacked me and punched me in the face where I got that tooth pulled out. Sana, thank you so much. You guys can...
so uh, uh, yeah, everyone's just you know. I'm, I'm Love and sure. prayers. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Aaron, I love you as a fan and always will. And I am always going to be here fro you. Just let me know. Tall underscore Derek on Instagram. Thank you so much, Tall under uh, Tall underscore Derek on Instagram. Shout out to you. Um Yeah, I honestly don't know how to feel at this point. Um Um, if you guys have any questions, you can do text to speech. Um, I have way too, many, way too much going on in this speech. Mel is the greatest of all time. Yeah, she's an abuser. You must be one too. Birds of a feather flock together. Free Rocky Reina. Shout out Rocky Reina. I appreciate um, starting to understand who I am a little bit more. Um, so I will definitely give a shout out. Uh, Anna, thank you so much. Uh, it's Denise and Cole. Thank you so much for your donations. Um, yeah, I just. Yeah, I, I, I keep it real, but at the same time, it's like. I'm not gonna let a crazy a crazy woman wrote, uh, hold me back. I wrote this song right here years ago, premonating that I was going to have a girlfriend like her, right here, and it happens to be her favorite song. It's crazy. It's her favorite song. Cause she wanna leave, but she made me follow her. It's about using a man, so it's probably gonna be my next single. Donate if you like this. This is unreleased, please. Even a dollar to show your appreciation. Thank you, se sexy Bexy. She always talk about the fun of things. I'm thinking about if she deserves it. said you're better off without her abuse is never okay I have a first of all I am so sorry secondly did you see Jenna Shea's comment what was Jenna Shea's comment I don't care about these people I have no self-worth Homeboy got abused by a girl. Yeah, I did. You know why? Because I don't put my hands on females. And I don't have a criminal history. What happened to taking Peanut to the vet? I had... I'm getting that dog out of my possession. Um, do I have any of my mods in here right now? Any mods in here? I have no mods. I need mods bad. I did get the dog help. I had to return it to the mother, okay? Lawsuit incoming? Bring it, bitch. 
and a man deserves bitch. I did get the dog help. I had to return it to the mother, okay? Lawsuit incoming. Bring it, bitch. Anyway, um, thank you. Uh, no man deserves to be uh, cheated on four times in a row. And then when I say, please get out of my house, that you decide to lunge after my, my money maker and the thing, my like what I make music for. All right? She's the one in jail. All right? Not me. She's the one in fucking jail. This is not okay that, that I was treated like this. Get rid of Amanda. We need more mods up in here. He's going to cry. No, I'm not. I got out of a very bad relationship with a girl who was using me for clout. Okay? Alright? Attacking me. Telling me she's pregnant with my baby and that she's gonna get uh, uh, an abortion. How did she break the dog's leg? I don't fucking know. I, didn't, I broke up with her in the morning and then I saw her at 10 o'clock at night and she got arrested for <laughs> Thank you, Sana. I don't know. March 30th. And I would never speak to him again. Why would I? Would you ever speak to somebody in your family Ever again, send them an email saying, I love you so much on Christmas, six, four, five, six months after you got a restraining order and accused him of wanting to and set him up for murder for hire. Yeah. You know, all kinds of crazy shit. I feel you. I got one thing to say to that. Get out of here, you bitch. So then March 2020, there was a domestic violence incident where, Aaron, you claim that the woman sitting next to you right now choked you. And the police came and she was arrested? Yeah, she was arrested. <sighs> For the first time? <laughs> For the first time, yeah. yeah. Uh, it was, uh, I mean, she was going through hormones and stuff while being pregnant where we didn't know that she was pregnant. Hmm. And there were some personal issues that were going on in the relationship that kind of were already, there was no foundation, right? You know, like, yeah. first time. Yeah. Choked you. And the police came and she There was a domestic violence incident where, Aaron, you claim that the woman sitting next to you right now choked you. And the police came and she was arrested? Yeah, she was arrested. <sighs> For the first time? <laughs> For the first time, yeah. Uh, it was, uh, I mean, she was going through hormones and stuff while being pregnant where well, we didn't know that she was pregnant. Hmm. And there were some personal issues that were going on in the relationship that kind of were already, there was no foundation, right? You know, like, yeah. I, I mean, I don't know. It was, it was a misunderstanding. Yeah, and the cops didn't really give much of a say. I came out with my shirt off, like, yeah, and she was really trying to just like pull me closer and, I, Obviously, she's got crazy ass nails, and I was like, knock it off, you know what I mean? And they saw that, and then they didn't really give us much of a choice. So, okay, well, Melanie Martin, yes. ladies and gentlemen, uh, how would you say the situation went before the police showed up? How the situation went? Yeah, from your point of view. From my point of view, like I said, it was just a big misunderstanding. It we I did not think it would go to that point at all. I didn't think we would it would I would be so aggressive and you know, and me too be that way. And me too. Yeah. Like, it takes two to tango, man. Well, so, in, like, in the articles, it said that 
you were trying to break up the relationship and you were asking her to move out. Yes. And that's kind of led to the choking and the punching. Well, she, we had a disagreement about, you know, something that was a boundary that was crossed. And I had, I had let her go at, at about, we broke up at about seven o'clock amicably. And she went and did a pregnancy test and came back 12 hours later to show me the pregnancy test. And I was like, I don't know if I believe this or whatever it is, you know, and this was, you know, before she got arrested, you know, that same day and comes back 12 hours later at night, shows that I'm like, nah, I don't want to do that. So, and she was extremely hormonal, like, it was, and um, I have a lot of sisters, Dave. So there was no reason for me to like get any EPO or press charges or do anything like that because everybody like deserves a second chance in my opinion. And it was, there was a lot of emotions going on. There was a lot of lessons learned. And I mean, I don't. I don't know. What would, What would you say about 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 it? I mean, that that we um, that it's in our past, and we're trying to not make the same make mistakes. The same mistakes again. Yeah, like yes. and, and and that we've dis- we've been discussing with you know with Frankie. My um, he's helping manage me right now, uh, and just how we didn't really have a solid foundation you know like what what was he you know like it was it's it's just like a relationship is based on a solid foundation and yeah, it, we have it now so so we didn't have a solid matters. foundation so it all crumbs it's just like a relationship is based on a solid foundation and yeah, it, we have it now so so we didn't have a solid matters. foundation so it all crumbled well you went on youtube i guess right afterwards and you said my trachea and then you showed like a scratch on your arm. Scratch on my side, and then she definitely uh, uh, came at me <laughs> because she wasn't, and I don't know if like her, she was just flailing her arms all over the place, but she got me good. I couldn't talk for like two days, and but it wasn't, it wasn't like, it, it wasn't like she was like, ah. what are you doing? I'm getting ready. Oh, I like your lashes. Oh, thanks. They're fucked up, though, but... Makeup. Makeup goals. I like it. Thanks, babe. I like her for you. You do? Wow. Yeah, she's Selena. crazy. I like her. <laughs> <laughs> I heard she beat you up or something. <laughs> Good job, Melanie. <laughs> you would say some shit like that. Yeah, the other one was too nice for you. Like, she's like too good of a girl. You don't need a good girl in your life. Well, we we dated for okay, maybe five months now. Yeah. Well, and when did you well, ask her to marry you? Just a couple of days ago. On uh, Sunday night. Yep. Sunday. Sunday night. How did you guys get back to talking? How did we get back to talking? I showed up in front of the house. I showed up in front of the house. Yes. She showed this? Up. Yeah. And you, when did you ask her to marry you? She's like too good of a girl. You don't need a good girl in your life. Well, we we dated for okay, maybe five months now. Yeah. Well, and you, when did you well, ask her to marry you? Just a couple of days ago. On uh, Sunday night. Yep. Sunday. Sunday night. How did you guys get back to talking? How did we get back to talking? Uh, I showed up in front you can of tell this her. house. <laughs> I showed up in front of this house. Yes, she showed this, see, that's the crazy shit I like. Yeah. <laughs> if you want somebody back, you go to their house. Good job. I realize I'm not happy with my life. Oh, like, I couldn't do it. And I do it. Like. <laughs> If somebody back, you go to their house. Good job. I realize I'm not happy with my life alone. Like, I couldn't do it. And do it. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do with academics. I'm just going to go show up to his house. 
Oh, the academics? Yeah, well, mm-hmm. if you want your man, go get him back, girl. Shit. Academics I'm gonna do that shit. With you too. And keep reinventing myself, all right? We're different. He's cool. I do my thing. We talk. We're good. Not the same guy. You don't see his shit charting. Oh, the black the the black web documentary will be the end all be all. You just gotta rise above it, man. You say you know, stay strong, stay who you are, and God will protect you. That's why with all the bullshit that I've been through, I don't get in trouble. I win. No, I did not sell 10 million records. I have it on my wall. I count it every day. It's so stupid. The plaques are there. Protective restraining order against me. Protective restraining.